and outside. Yeah, I, I didn't want to talk on it. Hide as much as you can. You know what I'm saying? My wife, she wanted to get it when we first got it. I told her that. I went to that. Me. That's wild. So what's going on, folks? We're down here at Celebrity Cars and Coffee. Morning, morning. How to do everyone welcome to celebrity cars and coffee this fine saturday very humid humid saturday that's nice Big block. So I hope everybody's doing awesome this fine Saturday. Southern Rods, what's happening? Good morning to you. It's like that ivy gold interior. A fair lady. There's some couple of cool cars down this row. I'm back on the gimbal today, folks, so it shouldn't be too shaky. I think with the temperatures we got, I could get away without using the fan today. It's a beautiful galaxy. Nice Mordor. Console car, air condition. What's up, Mike? It's nice, hot, and sticky out there in Pahrump, too, huh? Hey, look, a Chrysler Sebring. <laughs> yo, 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 truck, what's happening? Yo, 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 truck, what's happening? cool little rat truck Sebring I think it's a classic might be a classic <laughs> Ooh, nice green 59 what's up pilot I like that shifter. It's the old style. The old style. Yeah, there's a couple of VWs here today. And I drove my VW down here today. First time all the way on the freeway. Whoo, that was a little sketchy. A little sketchy, but I knocked 18 minutes off my time taking the freeway down here versus an hour. Franklin, how's it going? There's a hot one. What year is that? 40 beautiful car rolling the unibody awesome we'll see you out there tomorrow hopefully we hopefully we'll have a rain free morning because uh we're not supposed to get any rain today until about two o'clock so hopefully i did good by taking my chances to come down here we won't get hit with rain by the time i get home because i have no wipers and the brakes suck the tires suck <laughs> so we'll see they go to rat see ya <laughs> sounds good huh uh maybe 
As long as it, as long as this is, is dry, it will be there. <laughs> All right, see ya. Yep, there's a VW meet. VW meet down at uh, Finley North VW, I believe, tonight. As long as we don't have any rain, maybe we'll have some cars out there, you know. There we go. We got Supra. Supra, right-hand drive job, too. It's a huge turbo, huge turbo, right hand drive jobby. Folks, if you enjoy these Saturday morning walkthroughs, smash that thumbs up button. Let YouTube know that you like them, so they'll pop them out to everybody. Appreciate it. It definitely helps the channel. Good morning, Will. Let's go back to this SRT8. <laughs> it's an SRT8. It says so on the badge. Good morning, Chad. See? Bet you didn't even know. Good morning, gang. Thanks for coming out, folks. I appreciate it. It's that beautiful 59. Got the rocker. Got the rocker guard. I love that color. Yeah, it's a cool color combo. It really is. Fifty nine. I think I got the newer one. I got the seventy two blue one up in the front. <laughs> yeah. Seventy two? Yeah. It's the blue and white one parked at the curb. Oh, I got right on. Right on. Yeah, right. Brother, right? <laughs> Oh, right on. I need to get a Speedo. It's a bone shaker car. This one's Spike. What's up, Adam? How's it going? Marcos? Sherry? Hey, how's it going? This is Spike. Supercharged. Got air tanks. Air tanks. He's a bone shaker, folks. This is a bone shaker car. Raven. Plum Bob, yeah. Look at that beauty. CST 10. Never seen that badge before. You guys ever seen that badge before? Fifty-seven, Chebby. Yeah, this thing's pretty nice. Looks like the bed has never been used. Beautiful truck, but like I said, I've never seen the CST badging before. 
427Z06. Here's some more, some more VWs. CST. I've never seen CST10 before. Custom? Maybe it's short for custom? <laughs> I don't know. Alberto, there you go. Thanks for the super chat, sir. Ooh, I like that ship ball. It's got the sparkles in it. Always wanted one of these buggies. Maybe custom sport truck, makes sense. Strange Brew. That was a good movie. You guys ever seen the movie Strange Brew with Bob and Doug McKenzie? It'll have you cracking up. You like that Canadian humor? Yeah, they don't do lacquer anymore. They have something like a ceramic. Back from the SCTV days, Strange Brew. You should check it out. It's funny. Yeah, Alberto's awesome, man. Even though I love that thing. Oh, it is I like your gauge holder down there. Did you make that? Uh, George did. I oh, okay. Did. But we uh, I like had it. some water jet. We had it water jetted to kind of match the pods. Yeah. Us, you know what I mean? That's what I mean. It looks, it looks perfect. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I like it's it. off a little bit, but that's the whole point. I think your, da your dad was telling me that your speaker grill things are like tail light rings. Yeah, they're these. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. And the rear, I'm the pretty rear are speedometer beauty rings. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. The beauty ring for the speedometer. Down there. <laughs> Just trying the to find rings. I like it, dude. Little it works. things you could repurpose. Yeah, I was tripping out when your dad Volkswagen. told me that. I was like, wow, that's cool. That's what Volkswagen <laughs> did. I see your dad in this thing more than I ever see you riding it. He hasn't driven it in a while. Oh, so you get the same way when, like, my kid drives my car around. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> did you get them from Heinz? I like the VWs. Here's another one. This one's beauty. Look at that. They're twins. One with patina. You guys like the the buses? All them windows. Look at all them windows. There's another bug over here. Oval window. Fifty six. Like the prowlers. Look at the Ferrari. That's a nice Ferrari. I don't think I've seen that model before. What's up, Trug? Grandpa had a bus. 
my granddad had a bus too. That's one of the reasons why I was never allowed to have one. We lost him in a, in a mountain, a mountain rollover in his VW bus. My dad never let me get one because of that. But I've had, I've had all the other VWs except for a notch back, really. <laughs> it's a nice Ferrari though. Yeah, I believe it. We're supposed to have a meet tonight at the VW place, but if it's raining, I'm not going. <laughs> All, right, okay. All right, we'll see you later. All right, let's go check out some Porsches. Oh, they go to Cadillac. 914, 1.8 liter. Morning, morning, there. Morning, morning. Yes, folks, if you enjoyed these Saturday walk around videos, smash that thumbs up button. It helps me out on YouTube quite a bit. Appreciate it. Chester. Right? Yeah, nothing in the morning so far, but later in the afternoon, <coughs> these clouds will be all over the place. Ronnie. What happened, Ronnie? You don't like the VWs? You typed all that out just to delete it? You want to see the Grand National? Norman. Thanks, Pussycat. Appreciate it. Welcome to the show. Look at that Porsche. That thing is wild. It slammed. We've got a YouTube visitor here today. Adrian's supposed to be out here. I don't know what he looks like, and I haven't met him yet, but he's visiting today. I really like that Porsche. That's really nice. It's a really nice Porsche. Let's go down the vet row here. Chester, thanks for the super chat, brother. Really appreciate it. Will, good morning. Glenn, good morning. I like white. You want to see the you want to see the Mini Cooper? Those things are a dime a dozen. Chester's awesome. Alberto's all, all you guys are awesome. I appreciate each and every one of you that come out every weekend. You guys are the best, the best. Bets, 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 bets. That and I like the I like I like the blue. It's a turbo. Is it eight thirty by chance? 
It's 8.30, Scott needs to do the national anthem. You guys ready for national anthem, folks? That beautiful car. And our buddy Phil brought out his uh, gasser today. We'll go check out his. We'll go check out Phil's gasser. You guys like gassers? All right, let's go see Phil's gasser. This one's pretty cool. Mr. Gasser. So I know Phil didn't hang out too long the last time he brought it out, and I didn't get to get it on camera. Whew, starting to get sweaty, folks. I should be at the South Point show. Yes, I'm not putting a car in there, but I'll be there to hang out with y'all for sure. Yeah, the T-Bird Gasser. It's a one of a kind, folks, one of a kind. Phil is a big supporter of the Rotter Files channel. He's an awesome guy. What do you see his AMC's building? Vroom vroom. Vroom vroom. Vroom Let's hear it. Vroom vroom. Yeah. Yeah. Open. <laughs> we'll get, we'll hear it. We're going to, we're, we're going to rip it. Did you turn it on? Yeah. Oh, open header. Mm hmm. Oh yeah! No, it's not your daddy's 289. Hmm? Morning, Larry. How's it going? Whew, can't wait to get on the other side into some shade over here. It's getting hot. It's getting hot. We had another T-Rex like that one pull in here, but I don't know where he went to. He went down the aisle and didn't come back out, so. You wanna see the spoiler? talking about the part of the rag top that comes out that pops up Ronnie <coughs> it's getting warm so the screen's getting dim it's getting harder to read stuff
I think that's what you were talking about, but there you go. There's the spoiler for the sunroof. Scott's going to be doing National Anthem here in a minute. Give me a second to get in the shade and cool off. Stripes and bright stars through the barrel of spine. For the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming, and the rockets rippling, the bombs bursting in. Proof through the night that our flag was still there. Oh, say, does that star spangled banner and we or the land of the free? And the home of the brave. Kenny Miller and the Rotter Files is here. Jerry from Headlights and Tailpipes is here. Everybody, thank you very much, folks. Have a great week. Uh, enjoy the car show. Stay cool. Simple coffee's up here with coffee and cold water. Give me a few minutes. Okay. Debbie's here hanging out, selling some jams and stuff. Make sure you take some of those home. Robin's here selling some signs. You gotta check out those See, signs. Front there. row. They're really super cool. One-way <laughs> side stop signs, perfect for your garage. Go check it out in perfect colors too. There's a red sign over there I got my eye on. And uh, wife is up here. Uh, we didn't get to see Mitch's car last week because he took off before I could get to it. If you're familiar with the old green Dodge Seneca that we used to have here, that was Mitch's. Now he's got this. Prime parking spot, indeed. Stop by and check it out. What place to music? Thanks again, folks. Look at that. All right, catching the live. Thanks for coming out, appreciate it. Welcome all the new viewers. The 69 Camaro is pretty awesome. got a wicked cool paint job on it. It really needs to be seen out in the sun with all the sparklies. Yep, and Alberta it's doing wet better. Uh, we've been getting rain in the evening times and some nasty storm weather for about 10-15 minutes worth. Then it goes away. And then it leaves this humid crap behind. Look at that beautiful Mer. Hi, I'm Ralph Bone. Hi. Oh, oh. <laughs> finally good to meet you. <laughs> well, yeah, but I, mean, I saw you there, and I thought I would just say hi. Well, I thought I appreciate uh, it. I like a nice picture of you and your son yesterday. Thank you. We were just roaming around. Thanks, Ralph. Cool. I've seen that guy on Facebook quite a bit, but I didn't even know who he was. Look at that Merc. 
That's his El Camino. Awesome. There's Pops 33. What's up, bros? Yeah, the El Caminos are cool. A little tight fit on the inside of the El Caminos, but they're definitely cool. This right here is my dream. There's my dream car right there, the Merc. I love it, just the way it looks, even without the chop top. Even without that chop top. Look at this thing. I'd still put an LS under there, but I like the Mercs. Nineteen ninety nine Mercury. <laughs> I want I want this generation. I take this one right here. I like this. Lead sled, yep. I don't think I've seen one without a chop top in a, in quite a while. Oh, the CST on that truck, yeah. Right, if you don't like that car, you don't like cars, man. For sure. Here's the new stuff back over here, regular parking lot. We're a little thin today, folks, it's just because of the weather. We got a new guy out here selling signs. Some cool patina type signs, metal, metal work. I'm not showing you the Jeep, just waiting for him to drive by. But I do like the pickup, the pickup versions of that. I do like that version. Not the old, not the well overpriced dealership version. Oh, is Doyle here today? We got the yellow stuff for Doyle. We got the yellow stuff for Doyle. Uh, we have we have more than 50% chance of rain due uh, around two o'clock today. But again, it'll probably last less than an hour. And then it'll come back over the evening like it did last night. It's supposed to rain yesterday, but it did not until about, I don't know, seven, eight o'clock. Oh, Michael Hogan's out here today. I think we saw the other car. I don't think I've seen this one out here before. The Dodge. Cruising. Nice old Ford. inside of the Dodge. <laughs> Love them backfires. Did you hear that backfire in the video? That and I always like the Ram. They have a couple of different ones, but they have better ones than that I like. Oh, you heard, you heard it? <laughs> Take all the goddamn uh, warnings. 
And folks, if you didn't already know, we're down here at Celebrity Cars and Coffee, 9500 Eastern Avenue, every Saturday from 7 to 10. And that's the man Scott right there. Scott and his band are going to be performing at our car show, The Trunk or Treat, this year. Make sure you come out for Trunk or Treat. It's going to be up to Silverton, and it's going to be awesome. It's all done for the kids, folks. And this is Jerry. Here. For the Aussie guys, they like, they like these Falcons with blowers. Best car I ever had? Well, I, I, I always like my bugs, but I also had 77 Regal, 77 Cutlass, 77 Cadillac Coupe de Ville, and I love all three of those. My 79 Z28 was an awesome car. I had a 77 K5 Blazer with a 383 Stroker in it. It's another one past everything but a gas station. <laughs> I've had lots of VWs. It's hard to pick. I had a 61 Corvair, which I had the longest at all of them. I think I had that one for about seven or eight years. And that one was a fun car. Check that thing out, though. Look at that. I'm 49 years old, and I've had 63 cars up until now, from the age of 16. It's a beautiful car, isn't it? It's a 1936 Auburn Boat Tail Speedster replica. So it's a replica. Replica. Oh, the Supra. Auburn. Love the Pontiacs. Got a 326. Classic Mercedes. This is a Kubota top, I think. <laughs> it's the low rider. Good morning, Hass. See ya. Yeah, the caddy. I like the cars from the 80s, too. It's my generation. I was born in 73, so I grew up in the 70s and the 80s. That car is social media famous. Uh, Raiders events. You'll see it at Raiders events. You used to see it at Dodger events. <laughs> now he's a Raider events guy. <laughs> For the prices they charge to go to teams, I am not. A, I have no favorites. Not at all. Not at all. Sixty-four Riviera. Yeah, I like those cars too. Those are pretty. Definitely got a lot of class in the Riviera. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm not a Raider fan. Was a Raider fan out in California until the cops and the gangbangers start harassing you. So, yeah, I don't follow the sports on that.
There's a nice patina. The movie colors. Oh, indeed. I went to the theater when they had that in <laughs> in Compton with my buddies. Uh, yeah, it was bad that day. <laughs> it was definitely a bad day. <laughs> Especially to be white in Compton going to see the movie colors. Yeah. Let's just say it was fun. Thanks, man. It's still a work in progress. It's got a lot of stuff, but again, I did actually take the freeway all the way here this morning, which I'm a little impressed by. It only knocked 18 minutes off of my time, though. <laughs> still a little sketchy driving it. Look, there's, there's Mitch hiding back there behind my car. He owns that beautiful white Dodge over yonder. Hey, hey! <laughs> Yeah, And we got the music happening over here, so we're going to skip on out of here. It's too loud. Let's see, I'm going to mute it for a second, folks. Just going to mute it for a minute. Yeah, can you hear me now? Is my mute off? The blue and white bug? Yes, sir. That is my 72 Super Beetle. I just didn't want to get too close because they got a lot of that music going on over there. Chris! My buddy Chris. There goes our, our local buddy with the vet. There you go. Three different generations of it right there. Take your pick. Alberto, which one do you want? Which one do you want, Alberto? Left, right, or middle? You want that one? You want this one here on the right? The Z06 tuner? Wow. I'd have never guessed. I thought maybe the middle one. <laughs> it is a nice looking car though it is definitely a nice looking car wide body kit, big wheels Targa funny you say that Mark a lot of people do actually leave their keys in these cars but if I caught somebody doing it I'd more than beat their ass <laughs> I would never do that. I might make fun and say it would, but I would never do that. Yeah, this guy's Northwest Garage right here. Finally came out to this side of town. Oh, it was still loud. No, it was, it was not <laughs> even open. Only uh, eight. So I just want to apologize to anyone. Oh, didn't see, he, he wasn't. They weren't fully open on the gasser, but it still sounded awesome. Everybody gave it thumbs up. <laughs> Is the servo not working? I, when I, I had to take them off. I repainted the bottom of the collectors, um, and when I did that, when I put them in, I didn't. I didn't like line it perfectly up oh. the tubes, and so that's getting. They're getting hung up. And we'll get that fixed, and then, then next time it'll be nice and loud for you. <laughs> Here comes Mike. Here comes Mike in the milk truck. That awesome, awesome Divco. What's up, sup? I love that thing. We get to hang out for a minute. There's going to be people pulling in and out. 
We get to hear some cars rolling out. Oh, I didn't see that green thing. That's a welder up, welder up car. Well, he got a big welder up sticker on him. I don't know, it was a welder up car. Once again, folks, if you're new to the channel, this is Celebrity Cars and Coffee. We're here at 9500 Eastern Avenue. On a good weather day, we average 300 to 400 cars here when the weather is awesome. Regularly around 250 right now, 225, because it's a tad bit humid. And we're here from 7 to 10 every Saturday, 9500 Eastern Avenue, 7 to 10 every Saturday, Celebrity Cars and Coffee. Come on down, folks, if you're in the area visiting or if you live here. Cool. Let's see who else is getting ready to roll out. I heard some Camaros. I'm surprised they didn't roll out at 830 going over to Shelby. got a couple of supers out here now Camaros are started up yeah the strip got nailed with rain the new Circa Casino waterfall coming out of their sports book and the TVs in the sports book. It was crazy. And if you guys follow it anytime here at the link, the links parking garage always floods and has a waterfall action happening in the back. It's crazy. This town isn't built for water. What was that? Just like the drag race, I wonder. Right, of all these classic cars, uh, there's been days in this lot, I'd say well over a million. Right, Scott? Uh, yes, correct. Yeah, see, correct. <laughs> Plenty of times it's been over a million. There's another buggy. I like the center lines. Yeah, well, if cars want to decide to roll out and uh, get out, we'll uh, cap some of that. Otherwise, pretty much people are bailing out. So you're telling me that that CST is supposed to be on the door, not the fender? Anybody new watching, we posted this up a little earlier here. It says CST slash 10. I've never seen that badge before on a C10 truck. I was just curious if anybody knows about it. the Divco. He brought his family out. Want to see the inside of that? Rolling the classic with the car seats in the back. Gotta have the, gotta have the child seat. Warsaw, Poland. What's happening, Fritzl? I'm sorry if I pronounced it wrong. That's a cool name, though. I like. I got, I got, I got some of that Polish blood in me. My grandfather, my grandfather is from Poland. On my mother's side. Man, that, it, it's so hot and sticky out here. Whew. My shirt's sticking to my back. It's not a pretty picture. <laughs> so, 
All right, let's see if we can get a couple rolling out if anybody's leaving here. Need to take a breather from my steps. Oh. Boston Mass, what's up, Bubba? Alex in Santa Cruz, welcome, welcome. Just about to the end, folks. We're just going to see if any cool cars are going to roll out right now. It's getting a bit warm. Can't wait till it cools off. You won't really hear me complaining about how cold it is, that's for sure. <laughs> I, I can handle and I like the cold. Yeah, I guess I was just a little little click a roll out there folks so i think we're done we're gonna call it a day till tomorrow as long as the weather is like this we will be at rancho and craig in the morning at another sunday morning cruise having a good time with y'all here comes that porsche wide body race car porsche sitting on the floor there goes that vet the one Alberto likes. Some people don't know that there's a stop sign there, I guess. There goes my baby. My baby's leaving. I want that car. Somebody get me that car. You have a great weekend too, Alex. Like I said, if you're interested, we'll be out, out again tomorrow morning out in the northwest side of town getting some of the northwest side cars because you know these guys don't cross town here. So we got two different spots to capture different cars. Once again, I appreciate y'all coming out. Love y'all. Peace. Thanks again for the super chats. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow. Peace.